fine aggregates are of sizes ranging from 4.75 millimeters to 150 microns. The quality of fine aggregates greatly affects the quality of concrete. I will take you through the process of assessing the quality of the fine aggregates. Natural sand, manufactured sand and crushed gravel are different varieties of fine aggregates. Sand should be hard, clean and free from adherent coatings, organic matter, etc. Fine aggregates should not contain more than 5% of silt, clay lumps and chemical impurities. The silt content should not be more than 3% for river sand and 15% for manufactured sand. These materials adversely affect the hardening, strength and also durability of concrete by initialization of corrosion of reinforcement. Any organic impurities like leaves, grass roots, decayed vegetation will interfere with setting and binding properties of concrete. Sea sand should not be used as it causes efflorescence, corrosion of reinforcement and retards setting, hardening of concrete. Damp sand exhibits more volume. This is called bulking. When the damp sand is measured by volume up to 15% extra sand is to be added to compensate for bulking. Sand should be so stacked that dust and other foreign matter are prevented from getting mixed with it. Due to adverse impact on environment by rampant mining of natural sand, the government is encouraging the use of manufactured sand, which is satisfactory for making concrete. Manufactured sand is scientifically produced in specially designed crushers to ensure the compliance with national standards. Users should not be confused between manufactured sand and crusher dust. Crusher dust is the waste product from manufacturing of coarse aggregates which have very high silt content and fine particles. Fine aggregate, generally known as sand, plays a vital role in concrete and mortar. It should be free from silt and impurities. Use of sea sand causes corrosion of reinforcement. In case of damp sand, up to 15% extra sand is to be added to compensate for bulking. Manufactured sand can be used but crusher dust should be avoided.